Audio Zone. Thank you guys so much for coming back. I just want to say I'm so sorry that I'm not making a lot of videos. I have school and everything, but soon the school is going to be done, so I'm so excited that I can make so much more videos. So last video I made a fidget toy, um, kind of a fidget toy haul, but I got oh, so much more fidgets that I didn't even know that all fidgets, like fidget spinners and just a bunch of different stuff. So I'm going to make another video, but this time I'm going to be rating my all my fidgets just out of 10. So yeah, let's just get on to the video. Actually, before we start the video, go check out my Slovak channel, Nadina Mia, so it's right here. And also, like and subscribe this video in 5 seconds. I think you guys can do it. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Did you guys do it? If you did, put a big pat on your back because you guys did amazing. Okay, let's get on to the video. Okay, guys, so here are my fidgets. Oh, that's falling. Whatever. So here are my fidgets. As you guys can see, I have a lot more than last video. Of course, I have a lot more, but, I, but I'm like, I'm the kind of person that I just can't find them. So I have a bunch more, but I just can't find them. So yeah, and also I just have new ones, as you guys can see. I did not use fidget spindles last time because I forgot that those are fidgets. And I have one more fidget spindle, but I can't find it. And I have multiple of these. So yeah, let's just, just get on to the video. I'm not sure how they're all called, all these fidgets, but but hopefully I'll somehow get it close to it, so sorry about that. So let's just get on to the video and let's get testing. We're gonna start with fidget spinners now. These are probably oldest because, my oldest, because you know, you guys know how old fidget spinners are and they used to be such in style and fashion, whatever. So this is like a superhero, whatever. It's very good, the only thing is that these little wings or whatever this is kind of bumps into this and it kind of doesn't really make it, so I don't really like it as well, so I'll probably give it a 3 out of 10. Next we have this beautiful one, I love this one so much, it goes so smoothly and it's so, it looks so amazing, and I'll give this a 10 out of 10. Last but not least, it's just this basic um, yellow one, and it actually spins so well. I love it so much, and I mean, the color's not just like wow, but it's not a terrible color as well, so I'll probably give this an 8 out of 10 because the color's just kind of bland, but it's actually really good. Next are stress balls. So, um, I have multiple stress balls, but I couldn't really find them because I'm that kind of ballzone again. So, this is just a stress ball. This is a store-bought stress ball. I think there's just, like, I don't know, a jello inside or something. It's actually so pretty on camera. I don't know why it's showing, like, a blue, but it's kind of like a pinkish purple one, and it has a little bit of blue, but it doesn't look the best on the camera. I don't know why. But anyways, it's, I love the stress ball so much. The only thing is it, it's kind of of leaking up here somewhere when I put it like it's kind of I don't really know how to explain it but it's kind of leaking so yeah but I, I love it so much and it only costs like two dollars and that is crazy for stress ball it only costs two dollars and I rate this probably a six out of ten although it's amazing again it leaks and yeah no actually I'm gonna put it at eight out of ten I think eight out of ten is good the next dress ball, I have this homemade dress ball, and I love it so much. There's only, like, a little bit of water, but mostly just, um, a flower, so, and it's actually so stretchy like that. I love it so much because you can just form whatever you want. Now, it's not like a stress ball that you can squish it and something actually comes out of it or something, but it's just so nice. Although this is homemade, I'll probably give this um, a decent 7 out of 10. It's actually really good, and it's not the best, but it's pretty good. Now we have squishies and whatever this thing is. So we're just going to start with this. This is um, a little thing that you put on your finger, and you like do that. I'm not sure really what it's for, but it's for something. I don't know. I don't really like this, honestly, because it's not really that fun to play with and everything. So I'll probably give this like a 3 out of 10 with them. I don't really like it. I mean, the colors are really pretty, but I don't really like it. By the way, I have a bunch of them, but yeah. Yeah. Go on to the squishy that I already had in the last video, but whatever. So here is my cat squishy. It actually rises so nicely. So I'm probably gonna give this cat squishy, I don't know, maybe like a 8 out of 10 because it does have this little slit on the top. But again, I had this squishy for like three or four years now. So that is crazy how good it's actually like how good it actually kept up. Next, I have this hamburger squishy, and as you guys can see, it is pretty worn out. As you guys, it's a whole huge hole here and everything. So, I mean, it's a really cute and nice one. It's my first squishy that I ever had, but again, it's kind of worn out and everything. So, I'm probably gonna give this probably a five out of ten. Last, but of course not least, is probably my favorite fidgets: all my poppets. 
Now, I don't have any dimples yet, but I would really like the dimples. I found some, but they, they were really expensive, but I really want the double dip it, dimples, but I couldn't find them anywhere around here. So, yeah, I have poppets, so I'm so excited. Let's start with this poppet. This poppet is actually is my last video. I had it as well. So, here is some ASMR. This is the quiet side. It's pretty loud for a quiet side. And this is the loud side. I love it so much. Although it's so loud and amazing, it's just a normal basic shape. And also it's purple. And on camera it looks pink, but it's actually a purplish pink, but more like a purple. But it's like pretty basic, but I'll give it a good 9.5 out of 10. And this is my newest poppet. It's this cute little ice cream. It has a really quiet side. And a really loud side. I love this poppet so much. Not only it is so loud and so amazing, I love the colors as well. And of course the shape. I give this poppet a probably a 10 out of 10. Of course I would like this side to be a little bit louder, but overall I think it's a 10 out of 10. But overall I love all my squishies and everything, all my fidgets, all the same. But if I had to pick my favorite one, it would definitely be this brand new one. And I love it so much because it makes amazing pop and it was only $3. And probably my least favorite would have to be this wing thingy. It just doesn't really make sense what I'm actually supposed to do with it. And I just actually don't really like it. And it doesn't really soothe me anyway. So, yeah, that's probably my least favorite. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys have an amazing day. And hopefully you like all these fidget videos. And hopefully I'll make more. So definitely hit that like button if you guys want to see me do more videos. Bye.